Uh, there's a couple things I want to do real quick. I know we need algae, so let me go ahead and actually have these guys come over here and take care of some of this algae just kind of laying around here, not doing anything except for just existing and not in my bins. So I need to be in my bins. Let's go ahead and do this. What is that? Phosphor? Probably. I'll take all this and this. I have them come up here and work on that. It'll take them a little while here. Um, there is a vent below your oil pool. I mean, I see a bunch of drains. Is it further down? I'm not sure I see what you guys are seeing, though. I mean, I have a ton of drains. Drains! Do I have a dupe with your name? I do not. Left side in the sand. So, left side in the sand. Yeah, I don't, I don't see it, guys. The black line of rocks. Man, what the... Oh, this. I'm sorry, I thought you were looking... I thought when you said vent, I don't, I'm sorry. I, th I, th I was literally looking for like a tiny little vent. Like a little vent that, that the dupe would build. Huh, I don't know what that is. I guess we should send a dupe over there to figure it out, huh? Let's, uh, let's do that. This is going to be kind of tricky because of all that sand there, so we'll have to kind of creatively make our way over here. Oh, actually, we can just go like this, like this. Perfect. We're going to find out what it is. Very shortly. Well, in a little while. Huh. I keep missing, I know. Sorry, I, did, I, I, I misunderstood exactly what kind of vent we were talking about. So listen, we have uh, a ton of water. We have so much water, we really don't have to worry about water right now. But I made this mistake before when I would just take for granted the fact that I have so much water and then what happens? I run out. Um, I am using water faster than it's replenishing. Now it's hard to tell because the vents, you know, the, these steam vents are just now running and this was dormant right now, uh, which is coming back up in 4.5 cycles. So. And this one is next door. So we, there's going to be a period of time here. Where we're going to see a lot of, you know, a lot of uh, liquid being added to this pool. But we don't know if it's going to be a, enough to counteract how much that we are taking from it. Uh, we're taking from this thing constantly. It is a constant drip coming out. Why are we backed up? <laughs> Why are we backed up? I was going to say it's a constant drip blank. But, you know what? Oh, I see. Uh, wow. Wow. We've got it backed up all the way out here. It's 116 degree water going through this biome. There's a lot of information on the screen right now. Oh, yeah. Did I announce my OnlyFans? I did already announce my OnlyFans account. Come see my nudes, guys. <laughs> uh, yeah, wow, that's backed up. I think what we should probably do is... Should we... I wonder if we should put a relief valve or relief vent back in here. So that way any of the excess will just go back in here. We'll, we'll constantly have flow. Just have it drip down here and it'll it'll work its, itself out. I think that's probably the smart thing to do. And this would be the point to do it right here. Just have this, have this come down here, jump this, and just have another vent right here. Boom. And that will make it a little higher. And then that will, uh, that will relieve the pressure at least. And it'll just cycle in on itself, which is not going to hurt it at all. It's not really going to cost me much of anything. We're running in slow motion right now, so we we got plenty of time to sit here and plan this. Um, Uncle Chat is in the vibe. Oh, Buffy looking out for Uncle Chat. Bam! There it is. Buffy, thank you so much. Really sorry I accidentally let you die. I really, truly am. Uh, I can't jump that there. Let me see. There's another point that I can jump. See, how do I have this set up? So that's, oh, that's clean water there coming out of that. That'd be an okay place to pull pressure, but then I feel like I'd be taking it from too soon in the mix. But you know what? Maybe, uh, maybe that's what we should do. Let's do that instead. That'll at least alleviate some of it by thinning out the amount of water that goes down this pipe. I don't think that's going to solve the problem, but we'll come back to it if it's not. And put a liquid vent right there and put a liquid bridge right there. 
Let's go and take a look and see if they finished that. Uh, they did, actually. So what do we have here? We have a carbon dioxide geyser. I... Uh, well, that's just going to stay right there, isn't it? <laughs> At least we... I'm glad, I'm glad you guys noticed it, because I totally did not. Uh, but it's not something that I'm interested in right now. And it is an infectious, polluted oxygen vent. So at least we know that we have plenty of oxygen if we somehow manage to run out. Uh, we should probably actually start piping this liquid in, though. I don't think we have anything. Yeah, we have nothing to really bring this liquid, uh, this water, up and out and into uh, other spaces here. Um, God, wow. I, I, It's moving so slow. Let me actually speed things up to see what it looks like at regular speed. This is regular speed here. Yeah, it's definitely slow. I think that, yeah, getting this... At least if I get this relief going then we'll get it filtered, right? It'll go up, it'll get clean, and the clean water will come back in. So at least we'll know, we will know there that it's gonna get filtered. Which means I could probably go ahead and grab the water from over here, because this is a ton of water, and just bring the whole oh, shit over. Baby. Just bring the whole thing over and just drop it off into here. And let this just be the main and only water supply. Which, knock on wood, we should probably be careful if we do that. Uh, Brian BL Tank, don't you miss the news? I know usually it starts around now, but it was, uh, it, I want to say it was a short news day, but it was like a regular news day, <laughs> lengthwise. Um, wait, hold on a second. Oh, that's because, okay, that's because of the, uh, it's missing the connectors. Yeah, I, I thought that was a liquid filter I put there. <sighs> Can those be re-rolled? Which, uh, which, the, oh, the, the geysers? No, no, not unless you re-roll the entire seed or something. Or something. I'm looking for, now I'm looking for other ones. Like, there's one right here. Right here. And it's not that far. Um, the only problem is I'd be... Oh, that's the problem right there, is I'd be going through a whole bunch of, uh... Of nasty. Vacuum. Wonder if... Uh, chlorine. Yeah, you know, let's work, let's work on getting this water out of here. Three more, let's see, there's one here, one here, and one here. Yikes, that's a lot. I'm willing to bet they're probably not all good. <laughs> Something tells me. But I don't want to crack the seal here. If I'm, if I'm going to go over here and take a look, I'll probably actually go out into space and then go down and then start digging through. Because if I go through this way, I'm just inviting all that shit in. But I do think the first thing that we should do is uh, start pumping some of this water out in somewhere that, somewhere else that makes a bit more sense. Um, which I do think is going to be over here. It's just, wow, that's going to really take a whole lot of, of digging I could, I could extend this straight down, and that would help. Then I could just run this pipe down here, which actually I already have a pipe here. Uh, and this is just water coming from the main line there. So I could actually snip this main line and then have... No, I can't do that because the machine runs off of water too. I could just make another one um, and bring that over. One could be a metal source, who knows? No, you're right. You're totally right. I, I, I am going to go and I'm going to um, tackle. As a matter of fact, just making myself a mental note. Uh, I'll go ahead and do this. So I think this is probably the best way to do it. It can't reach it right now, but... Oh, you know what? Uh, I could just have them put in a tile. I, I kind of messed up this area because I was doing the whole, like... Oh, I can't put a tile there. Put a tile here and, uh, uh, and a door. Because I, I decided to open up all of the containment units that held all of the uh, oxygen. And just to see what happens. And it just filled the entire space with, like, super dense oxygen. Let's see. Nutrient bar. Let's take that. Should take the curative tablet. Damn it. Um, hey, Mike. I used to be a huge fan of yours. The BFF report and early negative pH. What have you up to these days, man? I've just been just streaming. Streaming, making videos, stuff like that. Not really doing too much in the music space right now. I, I do have almost an entire EP. Almost an album. Uh, probably like 90% done. But I decided to shelve it for a bit because I just didn't, I just didn't like it. I was being a perfectionist about it. So eventually I'll go back and I'll... I'll uh, I'll finish it off and, you know, release it and all that, but, uh, but right now, I just kind of leave it alone. Uh, but yeah, other than that, just, uh, doing news, doing podcasts, doing, uh, taking pictures of people, stuff like that. Um, oh, good, so this is where you're getting this stuff, which is fantastic. I do need to get all this stuff out of here, so let's go ahead and do the rest. Uh, yeah, you... And then we can slide down in here and get some of this. We get this. Can they get almost all of this? That pause. I had to think about that for a second. There's a little bit of a pause. 
Uh, how cold is this room? Cold. Hey, look at that. It's green. Remember, it was stuck at like 58 degrees for some reason. It seems that it's a, it seems to have fixed itself. So that's fantastic. What's the air temperature coming out? Is 30 degrees, which is awesome. It is getting held up because, uh, as you can imagine, there's like just not enough places for oxygen to go out here. Mike's an only fan. Only fans now. What's up? Uh, and this is coming out at 42 degrees. So we have cool air coming from multiple locations. So we've, like I said yesterday, we've pretty much solved the, uh, the cold air issue or the just, just, just basically cold issue period, um, or the heating issue uh, that we had. Should probably go ahead and actually tackle this, like run a pipe over here or something just to cool this off. We have some, some oxygen here, but well, it's just not very cold. Hmm. Maybe we'll come back later. Just pump it out into space and make that thing breathable. Just pump it out into space. Oh, look, they did that one piece. There we go. This should... I, I am kind of curious to see what what it, what uh, this thing is. So we will tackle this right now. Let me... What's nice is that they're so close together. <laughs> and then this one, we could just run over. Actually, probably have them go further down. That way we could avoid the whole issue of uh, the sand all collapsing. So we'll go down here. Also give us a nice little view of whatever's down here. And then mm, we can go do do do, and then uh, done. All right, cool. So next time we check in, we're gonna have probably all these exposed here. It'll just take some time. <sighs> we had everything down here filling up with uh, with. Let's take a look at our yeah with hydrogen. Temperature is 110 degrees, so it's a little bit warm. Not ideal, but it's, it's you know it's doable. <sighs> What was I going to do next? I'm trying to think of what was the next thing I was going to do. Like, this is a lot of hydrogen here. I should probably go ahead and start setting up the cooling mechanism. Um, I want to figure out where that cooling mechanism is going to go. Or actually, you know what? How many Weezworts do we have? And do I need these Weezworts over here now? 67 degrees. I feel like we're kind of, we're probably keeping these things really low. 60 degrees. Let's let's do this. Let's, uh, let's see. Where's the warmest part of it? I would say that over here is the warmest part. Let's go ahead and uproot this one. Well, I need four of them. You know what? Let's uproot all of them. We will uproot these. And let's make another one of these. This entire setup, except for the electrolyzer. We'll instead, instead of pumping electrolyzer, or, uh, um, oxygen through there, we'll just feed it hydrogen and see how quickly it passively cools the hydrogen and then pump that back into here. So we'll pump it out of here cool it through one of these mechanisms, and then pop it right back in. Um, now, yeah. oh, oh, I guess, oh, you know what? You know what? Or, <sighs> I could just replant those things here and just see what happens. Just give it time. Let's do that. Let's do that time. We'll, we'll give it time. We don't have to start on it right now. We'll, uh, oh, they haven't taken those wart seeds out. Let's go ahead and prioritize those a little bit higher. Let me make those nines. Well, now they're going to sleep, so that's like happening right now. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll plant them right here where they originally were. And now that this is just completely, completely soaked in uh, in hydrogen, we'll be able to see just how effective they can be. Uh, the other thing we have to do is is remove all these, <laughs> all these damn tiles and put the uh, the appropriate tiles down there or the drain tiles down there. Can I do just b -b -b buildings? Good. Uh oh, pause building. So we'll go one, two, three, four. There we go. So they'll come around, they'll do that. Probably later. That's whenever they get around to doing this, I guess. What are they focused on right now? If they don't do, if they don't do this very quickly here, I'm going to assume that there's something going on. Something on a priority issue. Well, they just loaded phosphorite into the damn thing I just told them to remove. <laughs> They keep going down here. Okay, now they're working on this down here. I think it's because only one person is slated to be able to work on this stuff, and that's Lindsay. So what's Lindsay doing? Vitals. Lindsay is. Oh, what are you doing down here, Lindsay? Oh, she because she's she's taking care of these things. Damn it. Um. Well. <laughs> this one's useless anyways. So irrigation is just not, is not working out for us. Let's do this. Have her just immediately turn around and then come back and then take that thing out! Lindsay! Where are you going? Please tell me she's coming over here to take care of these things. Up okay, 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 okay. No, it's fine. It's fine. 
And now we'll go over here and tell it to Ward seed, plant, and then copy settings. And then we gotta wait a second for all of them to be up. They're all up and then we'll plant them here. So let's go ahead and take a reading here. Uh, we're looking at 115 degrees as natural gas generator. Now it has been floating around 110 for a really long time. And only recently, it, I would say over the past like 150 cycles or so, did it start to uh, uh, actually increase in temperature. Now it's up to 115 degrees. So if I put four wheeze warts here, surrounded by hydrogen, should probably work. And if this doesn't work, then yeah, I am going to build a separate machine, probably up here or something. Um, identical. Just make a blueprint, copy, paste, boom. And then that's where we're going to put the, uh, uh, and that's where we'll start uh, working with cooling the hydrogen and flooding this area with it. Oh, come on with the save. Was this, whoa, is this a freeze? Oh, okay. Uh, also, should keep an eye on this to make sure this stays cool, but it's at 62 degrees right now. I can't really imagine it's 63 degrees. I can't really imagine it being, or getting any any warmer than that. Uh, there's no oxygen coming from the, from the, oh, you know what? That's what we should do. We should patch in some oxygen here. Uh, let me see. Can I put a bridge over this to allow it to, yeah, I think so. This is how this will work. Just to give us another place to, to shove some of this cool air out. Because this is all pretty cool. Yeah, 40 degrees. It's plain, plain chill. What are we at here? They still haven't taken care of that one place. That one thing. I wonder. Oh, because, oh, they did. Because the damn, the planter box was, <laughs> was too damn high. Silly. Uh, How are we doing with this project down here? They have not touched it. Okay. We need to figure out, we need to find out what they're doing. What are we doing on a daily basis? Okay, well, we'll do it tomorrow, next cycle, because this cycle's over. But it feels like they're, they're building this. What's the priority of these guys? These are all fives. There's some nines here, but these are not interactable things that I have to worry about with these guys. Like, you're just going to grab some resources, fine. That's an eight, so that's just clean up. But there's nothing to clean up, so I don't think that's a big of a deal. Um, actually, we could go ahead and set that down to like a six or something just to get that out of range. Uh, this thing is a eight nine. That's going to stay stacked, but it's only going to hold just the uh, the phosphorite. That's it. Yeah, I don't see. I hope that they're not taking things out of the bins and then coming up here and depositing them into these into these receptacles. He just delivered dirt. Where did he get that dirt from? Let's follow the next person that comes down here to grab something. We'll speed things up. I'm getting suspicious now. What are these... What are these dupes doing? Look at these. <laughs> okay. Boots. Igneous rock. Where is he going with that rock? Let's follow. Okay. Hold on. Navy Devil. Navy Devil's got... Okay, so they're all working on this. Okay, 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 okay. Chaos has delivered algae to... To this? Yeah, algae. Why is he depositing that? Let's lower this a little bit. I think that there's some kind of war going on between some of these things. Where they're moving shit around. Don't micromanage me. <laughs> Let's make all of these bins. Like, that six. Uh, this is six. That's a six. Let's make these two sixes. That way they're above uh, normal, but they're not. Or average, but they're not, like, way too high or anything. Same thing with this six. These I'm going to leave alone, because this system works. Disable agriculture and algae from the conveyor. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a simple solution. Cause but wait, somebody dropped off dirt, too. Algae. Yeah, you're right. I was gonna just just remove it. Uh, fertilizer, phosphorite. Well, just, none of those things need to go down there. Da, 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 da. Organic. Here it is. Just look right at it. Algae. Okay, we'll take that out. Oh wow, it's loaded with algae. I mean, this up here is this six. Oh, you know what? I don't think I have algae uh, enabled for this. Uh, I will put it back in here though. So organic, organic, algae. There. Now I can load that up. Uh, five, nine, what? I know, I'm just trying to figure out like why they keep on making laps for something they don't necessarily need to make laps for. And here we go. So this is all done. We go ahead and put the mesh tiles in. Very expensive mesh tiles. And we'll put them in with some aluminum ore. Which is what's on the ground right now, I think, right? Yep, aluminum ore. Good. Mesh tile, aluminum ore. Good. 
How's this doing? Oh, they they never came over and put these in. I think Lindsay's the only one that could do that because it's has something to do with farming. Let me see. Priorities. Farming. Oh yeah, you know, I have a lot of people that just can't do it. Like they're just like X out from doing it. I don't want them touching anything. So that does count as farming, and so they're not gonna do it. Navy Devil though, I think if I put a couple people at like max, then that'll help balance it out a little bit. Who is I see. Farming uh, operating. Lindsay's just good at everything. Storing. I support attacking. Who has like minimal tasks to do? Everybody's got shit to do. All right, well, this is fine. I think just having that one extra person will probably make a difference. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Uh, yes, I did replace, I did replace Buffy with Biffy. Problem solved. Okay, so we're trying to see if that thing is going to uh, uh, do enough work to cool these areas once the Weez Warts are actually in. And maybe what I should do is now that this, it's a new day, let's go ahead and... Uh, let me see, I think I actually can click on the... Oh, it's going to be the farm tile still. Well, I'll give it some time. Let me go ahead and start mapping out... Oh, they're working on this over here too, which is great. But I'm going to start mapping out how we're going to get the liquid out of this. We already have that, so let's go ahead and grab... This and we're just gonna take all the liquid. I don't care what the you know what color it is green, white, blue. We're just gonna take all of it and we're just gonna pull it out and put it uh and put it in storage basically. Not storage, but put it into the the giant bin that we have. And then we'll put a liquid pipe. Good. Fuck. <laughs> oh man. I think it's time to go ahead and cut a nut. Just a tiny little hole in this abyssal right here. It's all dirt. It's all dirt above that anyway, so. Change, yeah, you change your Discord name too. I saw that. Get rid of that. Someone get rid of that. Oh, I guess I could. No, let's wait for him to get rid of it. Oh, where does this go? Look at this. Look at that. Handy. Uh, this is- oh, you know what? This- oh, no, that's all, um, dirt water anyways, so maybe we should- You know what? Maybe what we'll do is we'll actually go down and connect with- oh, fuck. You know what? Then if we do that, we might as well just go down the whole thing. So many windows. So many. There we go. We'll just do this. Go straight into it. There. Now it'll drain at whatever pace that it does, which, uh, because- because we're getting- a mix of clean water and dirty water. This is all dirty water. Hopefully it doesn't clog it up. If it, I'm gonna leave this pipe here as an emergency bypass because this is all gonna be dirty water coming out of this. So if we start this before we empty that water out there and we have clean water coming through this pipe, it's gonna flood because none of the dirty water is gonna come out of here. So we have to be careful with that. But that's a problem for some other time, me. <laughs> some, some other. For us though, we are going to just jack this into... It looks like we're just gonna... Hmm... <laughs> what the hell, Puffy? I wonder if we should take it down here and run it through this. Just make it part of this gang here. Uh, oh, no, maybe not. We'll just, we'll just put it... We'll just connect it right to this and just let it just go through the whole... the whole system again. Right? Yeah, that's the whole point of having that. This, this setup, so we'll just... Plug that into there. Let's uh, make that nice and neat, though. There we go. And again, like this is gonna be our backup. We'll just leave that up just in case. Just in case. Now, I don't have pipes or anything hooked up. Once I hook these pipes up, like this, this is it. It's over. Like we're just we're just gonna get just tons and tons of power and tons and tons of waste. So we need to get the transformers and everything else set up for it. Which I guess we could put right up here. There's enough room for transformers. Yeah, there's enough room for transformers and batteries up here, so we could create another set of, um, well, basically another couple circuits and then split things off. I mean, we already have circuits like, all over this place. God dang it. Like, look at this. We're running this off of three circuits, right? Like, almost all of this is running off of three circuits. Um, so if somebody runs the damn boom box 
while we are, I don't know, pumping water out of the bottom basement, you know, <laughs> basin here, that's all in the same circuit. <laughs> so something is going to give. Pip egg. Perfect. Um, This progress brings so much. It's allowed. Yeah, well, we've been busy. <laughs> we have been busy. Oh, we getting there. So wait, we, we, we dug into this. Oh, hold on. Come on. All right, we'll cut out one more here. Let's make this a night. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 come here. Shit. Come on, boots. Come on, boots. Come on, boots. Oh, we'll be, we'll be good. We'll be got it. Chlorine gas vent. Oh, shit. Okay, I want this, actually. Good. Okay, so that's, uh, that's great. Analyze. We'll get information off of it soon. Ooh, that's awesome. Because look at this, look at this beautiful basin down here that we can just clear. We clear all this sand out so easily and just drop all of this chlorine down in here. And then we have a whole bunch of water reservoirs and just disinfect everything at once. Um, hell, maybe even like grow stuff out here, actually. We can make a separate, you know, area specifically for, you know, these dupes to, uh, uh, to manage, you know, this, uh, uh, whatever farm we put down here and whatever water resources and all that. I think the bomb lily, like it likes heat too, right? Like heat and chlorine. Isn't that like the two things it really likes? Huh? 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 Hey, lion shadow. Thanks for that follow. I seen that. I seen it. Oh, I know. I know. I know. We're going to get in there. Pipe, pipe. We're going to get in there. I'm excited. I'm just excited. That's all. I'm just excited. I want to get in there and see what we're dealing with. Uh, oh, cool. They already built that. And they already built... Not all of it, but they're getting there. Give them time. Give them time. <laughs> Pied Piper, he's like, calm down, champ. <laughs> you're right. You're right. You're right. I'm getting really excited. Because uh, we don't know what's in there. Disinfect the polluted O2. We have the fight. <laughs> I don't think it works that way, but we don't, we don't, no, no, you know what? I'm, I'm lying. It will work that way. We can just shove it into tanks and the tanks just existing inside of a chlorine room would, that would take care of it. Like that would fix it. The only thing, the only reason why we, that would be difficult to do, the only, yeah, the reason why that'd be difficult to do is because we would lack the, uh, metal to make all of the, uh, all of the, uh, um, reservoirs. That's the thing that we'd be missing. Fucking metal. There we go. I wonder if I should go and turn this thing on. It's disabled right now. Uh, oh, it has no, it has no, uh, oh, so yeah, that's not going to work. So we'll just turn that thing off. Disable building. So we've got power. They're getting the liquid up. Good pipes. Good, good, good. There's some stuff in here, too, I want to grab. <laughs> Boy, relax. <laughs> I know. Aluminum ore. You know what? Let's grab this. And then we will... Yeah, this is fine. We'll grab all this. Mm. Oh, they can climb this whole thing, actually, so... Can they reach it? Oh, they can't reach that. <laughs> there we go. And then one ladder. Now they can reach it. It's all this non-obsidian stuff we could get rid of, and then we could just... We, it's like nice green abyssalite. Sorry, yeah, I said obsidian. But abyssalite, this abyssalite is never going to change. So we can um, just put a, a, a... Just some insulated blocks down here just to block that off, and it'll be fine. I do want to get in here eventually and get all of these poker shells that are in here. There's probably a ton of them in here. Let me see. Poke shell times one. Poker shell times white. They keep on breeding and just dying in there. Just swimming in their own corpses over here as well. Uh, you can use poker shells, I believe, to somehow make steel. It's part of the process of making steel. I don't know how or tungsten, I think, is what it is, right? I don't know. That's something that we'll tackle later. Wow, this is still not done, dude. The fuck? Who's Aaron? Lindsay, no pending deliveries. No pending deliveries. Where are the Weezwort seeds? They're gone. Oh, 
Where are my Wheeze warts? There were... No, hold on. There were four. I took one. And I moved it down. And the other three are gone. I don't have any pips around. One, like, one, two, three, four. I, 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 I... Or did I do all five? I think I did all five. Where the fuck are they? They must be installed in something. Because they don't show up as seeds. Control F. <laughs> Does that work? Damn, I tried. I'm desperate. Uh... But they're not planted, though. They're not in here. Like, it's not. It's a waiting delivery. I took seeds out. And then I... I, I need those seeds, damn it. Ah, lion. That's what it was. Thank you, Saturn. Um, I'm I'm legit confused here. Like seriously, guys. Like I I had five here, four or five. I think it's five. And I moved one down here. It doesn't show up on the list as me having any. Like, look right here. Wee's wart, wart seeds. Look. Let me get over here. You guys should read it. Look at wart seed zero. Why did it come down here? Wait a minute. Is it in here? Why did it say zero? Wart seed. <gasps> Allow manual use. If it's in here, can they not grab it? And if it's in there, why doesn't it show up on this damn wart thing? Don't no, she picked the wart seed? It doesn't show up on the list. Wart zero. Oh wait, it says three of two allocated depending errands. Oh. So it is zero because they're already committed. Oh my god. Okay. <sighs> Sorry. Jeez. What's in this bin? Gold? Okay, yeah. I guess, yeah, I guess it doesn't count when it's uh, signed, which totally makes sense. It absolutely makes sense. Good. Okay. Now we can see if this ends up working or not. Jeez. It's already at 112, so I think so. Fantastic. A bunch of those things will do the trick. Got worried for a second there. How are we doing over here, guy? Looks like they're just finishing up the wire. No, what is in here? Can we get that? Bunch of power wires. I'll take that. What is it made out of? Copper. Yeah, I'll definitely take that. Just like those dudes that robbed CompUSA that one time. Take all the damn copper wiring out the back. That was funny. How we doing down here, guy? Not working on it. Let's go ahead and bump it up a little bit. It's a five right now. We'll do a six because I want to see what these are. Gotta maintain the hype, man. I want it. I want it. Why is that receptacle always busy? Let's take a look. I think it, I, I want to say it's because it's the first one on the list. I want to say it's because it's the first one. Now they're manually coming down and dropping things off. Um, but it's the first one on the on this on this path here. I mean, was it Shift F three? Yeah. So you see. These ones are not sorting. Why are these ones not sorting? This might be a, this might be the problem right here. Four or five. What's in here? Gold amalgam. Is gold not on here as part of the? Uh, let's see. It's a uh, metal ore. Gold amalgam zero. So it's a thing. Why are they not emptying out? It's at four. It's at a four. Let me get out of the way here. It's at a four. Oh, it is full of fertilizer. Oh, you're right. That's the reason why. Well, these ones over here, though, gold amalgam, this should just work. Oh, wait, no, that's what's in line. Oh, it's the fucking fertilizers clogging it all up. Yeah, it's a fertilizer. Uh, let me just, I'll just make something support fertilizer and that will pretty much take care of it. Is there anything even in here? No. Okay, good. So we'll just do none. And then we'll grab agriculture, fertilizer, I think phosphorus is the other one. That'll take care of getting this thing moving. Oh, how funny. So I guess at some point in time it just got jammed up and because of, uh, uh, priorities and, uh, not priorities, but because of, uh, what, what can actually be sorted. And it got, yeah, that was it. 
I'm guessing I probably need to put another one up here because it's probably full of fertilizer and phosphorite. Yep, so let's go ahead and grab this and say copy settings and we'll just do that. Drop down on the ground and let it do that. That'll keep it moving. So I guess as long as we have like one or two bins that supports that, then uh, it should be mostly fine. This one is sandstone and iron ore. This one is phosphorite fertilizer. Oh, it's, I guess it's not gonna empty out of there, huh? Until it's uh, done. So let's do this. Let's do copy settings. That goes there and that goes there. There we go. So now the same way it's mirrored. So one, two, three, four holds the same thing. And that's just basically our overrun buffer. And that's it. How funny, man. Automation is hard. Conveyors are hard. All right, is this thing pumping yet? Nope. Pipe locked. Probably because the uh, bridge? Nope. Because, oh, because these two pieces. <laughs> these two pieces are holding us up. Your system was full of shit. <laughs> yes. Yes, that is accurate. <laughs> let's, uh, let's get this going. Come on, boom, boom. I want to get this water moving. Get it. I, I can I just say once again that I love that Killing Demon has both a helmet and a helmet. Look at this guy. Look at what a stud. What a stud. Just double it up, baby. <laughs> Let's see. Here comes the liquid. Chugga, 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 chugga. I expect wires to start popping soon. I really, truly do. This wire has got to be just pushing it. Ooh. Oh, it's doing okay right now. I guess maybe things are not on. Oh, because these are not on. Good. Good. So we should see this go across. Fantastic. And this is going to go right into... I can already see that I'm going to have to do this bypass thing. This is going to have to happen. Um, but let me see. It's going to go... Yep. Take turns getting in there. And it's going to go up and it's going to get dropped. Fantastic. That's good. That's good. And it, it's, it's a good significant amount. So that's going to be there for a good long while. I should put a valve in yeah you know what i should put an inline valve that way we can because same liquid types will mix so if i thin it out a little bit i'll be able to make room for other things so this is not an emergency we gotta move this thing right now but we should at least slow down the process a little bit upgrade the entire base electrical. <laughs> i need a post just for that upgrade the entire base electrical no 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 we're we're i, I think i did a pretty good job of keeping most of the electrical you know, tame. Like, I think it's mostly good. Alright, let's go ahead and... No, I can't... Oh, I can't squeeze it in here. Where can I squeeze this thing in? Here we go. Oh, no, because there's a thing there. Ah, oh, here we go. Yeah, we'll put it right next to this one. Uh, so in and out. And then we'll just snip, and then that's it. Snip, snip. And then we'll just lower it, and like I said, it, we don't necessarily need it to be running full time, full bore. Antarctica was 65 degrees Fahrenheit! I heard that it was uh, record highs. Next week, Mike, please report for your assigned duties. <laughs> I know, next week Mike's got so much work to do. How's this doing? Let me see. 108 degrees, it's dropped. So it's so far, I would say this is a success. Now, is this more of a success than just building a separate room and cooling it all together, right? Like like I'm doing over here, like just like mass cooling it. Well, we'll just I guess we'll just let it go and see. But if I could get if I could get these machines down to like 90 degrees or something like that, I would say that's pretty good. And I'll just I'll just take a couple of them out and put them over here. That way, this machine these this set of machines can run uh, a little bit cooler as well because these are sitting in oxygen. Yeah, they're sitting in oxygen. Uh, I. Probably should try to pump some of that out, but I think it's probably okay for now. I mean, I can't pump it out here because this is crazy amount of oxygen here. What is it in here? God, look at that hydrogen. It just blasts out here. This is where I should put some kind of a smaller pump or something. Another pipe dream! <laughs> the hydrogen going all through the base, and then it pulls up here nicely. Oh, we got something. We got a gift. I wish that was louder. Simple reed seed. Sounds good. Food's great. 139,000 kilocalories. Like, we're doing freaking fantastic with food. Uh, no risk there yet. Uh, cooking food is at, is, is, it's basically shut off. It's enabled, well, it's enabled by an automatic grid, actually. Uh, I wonder why they're not just making stuff then. Oh, because low priority? No, it's a nine, actually. 
Enable to automate. Hold on. Disable to automate. Oh, that's why. Okay. So they keep topping this off and that's turning that off. I was going to say, I thought that was full because it looked full, but I didn't see the green light. So yes, it's full. Can I put the power generation in the vacuum area? Nope, because it will just get super hot. Okay, here we go. We got a copper volcano. And, 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 and. Oh, we don't know. We don't know. Oh, man. So many options. So many. Did we end up, uh, did they end up getting this? Let's see. Chlorine gas. Uh, okay, they have not analyzed it yet. Let's go ahead and set it up. Oh, this one's actually going right now. Copper volcano. Woo! We can just let that pool in here. There's so many things we could do. <laughs> Although, we should be careful because, you know, a copper volcano is going to create uh, quite the ruckus in terms of uh, heat. We've already got plenty of heat over here, but we thankfully have a buffer. That's not going to last. Uh, it's phosphorite and all this stuff. What we see? Can we actually see the state change? Is that going to... Oh, it's like green. So basically what it's saying here is it's going to take thousands of cycles for it to happen. Why is this hot right here? There's a little... Or why is this warming up? Is that... Am I reading that right? This is getting hotter. Buried objects, slime. Eh. I mean, whatever it is, it's slow. It can't actually see it moving, so whatever. Oh, we got it. Infectious polluted oxygen vent. Okay, so... Uh, the water by the volcano came from the... Um, God, my cable gets, keeps getting tied up. Uh, it came from up here. It must have fallen through space. <laughs> Miraculously, and then landed down here, I guess. Because before, it, it stopped right here. So water must have came down and pooled and came over here. Uh, the coronavirus vent. Okay, so now I have a whole bunch of options. Like, I can... Where, where do I put this copper volcano? Uh, I mean, this is all this all exists in a vacuum here. And all of this is, is going to slowly be getting sucked out over time. So this will become a... a um, like, this will become a vacuum as well. Do I... Start cleaning up all this sand and all this copper that I could get my hands on and just make a giant chamber and let this thing just go ham in here. Because all it's going to happen is just all the heat is going to just going to get ejected out to here, right? Uh, all the hot air is going to go out here. We'll open that up a little bit more to make it a little bit easier. Now, I do want I do want to capture this chlorine though. Like this, I definitely want. I want this uh, to capture this chlorine and then uh, be able to use that for you know whatever I want. Drown that virus and chlor. Yeah, just put them both together and just let them let them work it out. I don't know if that's well. We don't need oxygen right now, so I, you know it's funny because I've been eyeballing all of this stuff. Boom, there it is, Casper. You reach space, isn't that GG? <laughs> no, <laughs> there just happens to be a, a a hole in my asteroid. There we go. We made it to space. <laughs> yeah, not yet. Not yet. 135,000 kilocalories. I almost feel like we're actually losing food somehow. And by the way, fuck these blossoms. These bristle blossoms. Like, they are just the pickiest. The pickiest. When it comes to this... It's infuriating. Uh, how much... How hot is this water? It's all hot water coming through here. Maybe that's the biggest problem. I'm not cooling the water enough. Slash some dries on the asteroid. Yeah, the water is pretty warm. I don't really have a cooler water source, though. All the water is 110 degrees. How quickly can you cool? If I have a room with a bunch of reservoirs and I cool the hydrogen going into that room, how quickly can I cool? A bunch. Oh yeah, those are all insulated pipes. The ones that are like orange in color. Like for example, I have this right here, right? It's all carbon dioxide in right now, but I could seal this room off and fill it pretty quickly with some hydrogen. Oops. Uh, in order to... You know, try to cool this room. Or I could just use pipes. Let me see. F7. Yeah, I could use pipes. I could just have the pipes go up and over. Uh, let me see. I don't know where I'd put them, but I could definitely get them in there and just have them zigzag. Da -da -da -da. Suck out some of that nasty heat. These things are at 90, 99 degrees, but it, it's like a lot of water. Like this is 10 keys of water at 108.5 degrees. Like that's a lot of water to cool. 
Yeah, your original tube did indeed reach space. Yes, that is true. <laughs> yes. Okay, what are they doing? Copper ore. Copper ore. They're delivering stuff. Where are they getting where are they getting it though? Okay, they're cleaning up. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Just don't want them doing anything stupid. As they sometimes do. What is this? Uh nothing to do. We could go ahead and seal this off. We might as well go and do that. Oh, you know, they're they're actually still cleaning some of this up, so. I said it. I'm not gonna have them start on this just yet. Because I want them to come up and clean all this crap. Which is what they're doing. A wall away, just make a hole. But it's not gonna. I mean, you have a point. But it's also not going to be cold. Unless I mean, unless I start cooling this room. I was thinking of just using these, right? Like, let these passively cool. They made it with the wrong connector. What? <laughs> oh, like the wrong USB, whatever. Let me do this. What the hell, Top? <laughs> oh, Valentine's Day stuff. Oh, shit. Let me grab this. And we'll just take it like this. Yeah, like this. Like this. Uh, this is going to be cooling thing. Calling thing. Cool. Ah, cooling thing. Mini B rip. Then if I take this and I put it like up here, so like two on top of each other here, and let them I have enough for it. Let me see. There we go. And we'll leave this clear. Or what is up here? It's all hot up here anyway, so it's not like we're really, like, not hurting anything by doing this. We will want to redo some of the piping. Not by much, but enough. Uh, let's see, we'll cancel this pipe, this pipe. Oh, that pipe was fine. Uh, let's see, this pipe, this pipe. Actually, all these pipes we'll get rid of. And then we'll redo this. You know what? We're just gonna redo all the pipes that zigzag through here. There we go. Um... Micro, mini, apple, orange, it's all the same. 700! Thank you so much! Woo! We made it 700! Let's go ahead and save this thing. Save as... I think I messed up my save... thing. Space Bros Alpha 800. It's gonna be our next milestone. I've been doing next milestone, but I have a feeling that I kind of fucked that up. So there you go. Nice! 701! No, 800. There we go. Let's go ahead and get our big picture. Big picture update. Graphics. Oops, no, I'm sorry. My game. Son of a bitch. That's one of the reasons why it was so, so slow. There, we'll lower it. So dumb. There's just so many things to keep track of, guys. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we'll get the uh, proper ventilation going here. Where we're gonna grab it from here. This looks good, actually. Uh, yeah. Tapping into that. This light again. Nope. And this is going to get fed into... Oh, we have to fill it with hydrogen first. So we have to let some of this hydrogen in the area, in the vicinity, go. So let's go ahead and start this process now. I think we just turn off this pump and just make this thing like, you know, 3,000 or something like that. And then we'll um, let this whole place build up. It'll slow down the production of, uh, of oxygen here, but that's fine because we already have enough oxygen in the vicinity. Oh, and I also didn't want to do... Oops, we want to leave this open. And then we're going to cancel the buildings. Blah, 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 buildings. So we'll cancel this one. And I think that's probably good. Just because we want to, we got to get, we have to get hydrogen in there. That's what, hey, that's what we're here for. Yeah, I appreciate it. I guess they're probably not going to dig this stuff out if it's not ordered to dig out. So I'll go ahead and tell them to dig it out. <laughs> Damn dupes. Oh, he actually finished it. <laughs> no, cancel Dika. Oh, I guess it's already ordered to deconstruct. They'll come around to it. Okay, so there's the pipe's gonna go in. Oh, I didn't actually route it. Hold on a second. It's a pipe. Okay, so once again, we go in. And we're gonna go... This is gonna be oxygen. Oh, this is gonna be stuff that we're going to just cool. So this could go straight in and just start cooling immediately. But then we have to have a path for it to come out. So we should probably go ahead and make another cut into our precious, precious abyssal lights. So let's do this. We'll go out this way. And then we'll go... Uh, that's gonna have that's gonna have a seal, so we might as well not do too much. And we'll go up. 
Nope, we're gonna go up this way. Oops, wrong type. We could paint over it. Fuck, no, 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 no. It's kind of a bitch to do that with the cancel it anyways. Alright, so we'll do it from there. God, man. Now we're gonna do regular gas pipe. Amateur hour, man. I swear to God. And then we'll run that over here. And we'll replace these with lots of insulation. There we go. We're gonna have a hole here for just a second. I'll, I'll seal it up once they're done building these. Actually, we could do this at least. And they'll be able to reach the rest, I think. <sighs> That's gonna take them a while. Copper. Well, I mean, I don't really need copper now, but <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Temperature-wise, how are we doing over here? Let's take a look. Uh, we are at 81 degrees, so it is getting warmer over here since we took away those wheeze warts. You know what? I almost think that what we need to do is um, start pumping oxygen out of this place. Like, I don't know where we're going to put it. Just put it in fucking space. Just to get rid of all the warm oxygen and then fill it, flood it with cool oxygen. But I want to get it, yeah, you know, I, I want to get more, e a better equilibrium here first where this is nice and cool. And then, you know, we could, we could start to spread the love. Uh, but if this food starts to die, then we're going to make, we might rethink that a little bit. I uh, just started the game on a cold map. I never imagined hope, uh, how hard it would be to make enough heat just to make food. Oh yeah. But it's not included. It won't be when I'm done with it. Recycle the oxygen through freezing room to cool it. But my freezing room is already dedicated to hydrogen. Oh, you mean like run it through this, like bring it back down, run it through that? So run another pipe in here is what you're saying? Oh, actually, you know, we can connect it right through. That's an exit point. Yeah, we could we could just uh, we could we could redo. We could run some pipe. We could lay some more. Totally. And bring all that down. This is doable. 